Hello and welcome to another video by Security Guide. In this video, I want to show you how you can uh, access the um, Hikvision DVR using a dedicated app called IVMS. And uh, you can simply use your smartphone or tablet um, to, uh, to access your DVR playback or control your uh, machine. So, the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to show you the software that you need to install. So actually on App Store, if you just type Hikvision, you can see a few options. The, the one that I have installed is called IVMS-4500 HD. Alright, if I just go back to that software and uh, try to um, register an account with them, you can click on the word register and then you can type your email address in this case i will type mine and then it will ask for a verification picture which will be NLF8 okay. all right if I click on get verification code this app will email me uh, a four digit code which I will find it shortly on my in my inbox just go back to the camera you can see that verification code is here and it is uh, 3554 right. just need to go back to the software and type the number Oops, sorry. Three, five, five, four. well that code will be um, valid for 30 minutes so you need to use it as soon as possible all right on the next um, screen you can see the username and password uh, you've been prompted to choose a username and a password to actually uh, register an account with Hikvision uh, I'm going to choose mine finish all right we have registered an account with Hikvision now but we've not added any devices yet you can add this device or more than one device even by clicking on the uh, plus sign but before I do that I will need to connect the internet line to the DVR I'll show you just simply connect the LAN cable the back of your DVR all right it's connected now then at the next step we need to go to the DVR's menu and under the main menu configuration and then on the left hand side the second from top will be a network option and then on the top menus we have access platform there is a QR code here that we need to scan it uh, by that app to, to find this DVR I'm going back to the app then click on plus sign and then you can see that the software is ready to scan that QR code as soon as I point it to that it will scan and will find the model number of the DVR with the plus code 
So if I just click on that plus code, is asking for a device verification code, which is on the same screen as the QR code. If I just show you that screen again, you can see it's there. And interestingly, you can change that as well to any code you want it to be. So for example, after I make, make this video, I will change that code um, just to um, limit the access. And you can see it's showing that the status of a DVR is online because we've just plugged the LAN cable to the DVR. All right, great. So if I just go back to the app and type that number, it's in capitals, C O C J J H. Yours obviously gonna be another code, which you can get it randomly by the DVR or you can change it to anything you want it to be. So click on done, confirm, and the DVR is added. So if I just click on that DVR, on that device, is actually there is a button of start live view straight away there so if you click on that then you are online so if I just wave my hand on front of that DVR there you go that's me my hand that's it all right, thank you very much for watching and uh, in the next video, I will show you how you can use this app. Thank you.